Hey everybody, welcome to another Photoshop CS6 tutorial. My name is Buddy Blackford and today we're going to be creating and modifying text on a path. Now, you can create a path using any of your pen tools and then um, add some type on top of it to be able to make um, a cool looking font or some cool looking typography that's going to look awesome in your, in your uh, next document. So let's go ahead and get started with that. It's going to look something like what we're doing here now. So I'm going to delete some of the stuff that I had already on here already. I don't need that. And my paths are gone now too. So that's good. So select your pen tool and just create a path. Um, there we go. And then you can just end your path. And make sure you have a path in there. Now go ahead and select your type tool and click where you want to start typing. Now, if you want to start typing from the left to the right, it'd be a good idea to have this uh, set over here to left. And click there, and where you click, it creates an insertion point. You can tell um, that you're on the path when you have your actual uh, cursor, it changes into uh, the font cursor, the type, tool cursor with a, like a little squiggly line through it that actually looks kind of like this. All right, now we can start typing. And you can see we already have some problems, but we have a type on a path. So that's pretty cool. And that's what we got there. So there's how you start typing on a path. Now, since we have a path, we're able to use our direct selection tool to click on the path and adjust it. Now I can like maybe spread this out a little bit so that um, it's not all really connected. So it's not like all together like this. And I can go into here and edit my, go back to my text and edit it a little bit. Maybe add some space in between, um, depending on how your path is. And you can, like I was just trying to show you that you can edit your actual path. And it'll change the way that the actual text looks. So that's pretty cool. You can also create the insertion point and move it around like I, would just, like I just did right there. So um, that's really nice. You can do that. As you can see, when it comes to the, it turns into this like little line here, and you can click and drag, or it turns to a, the cursor has like a little triangle on it. If you look at my cursor, and you can move that little X, and it'll move the path for you. So that's pretty handy. Anytime you go over like the the text, you can see that um, line there, and that's how you change your insertion point. So that is fairly. Uh, good to know <laughs> so that's uh, what you get um, if you uh, select a path selection tool here you can also do that which is pretty handy as you can see when I moved it over that way it flipped if you move it too far it, it uh, flips over which is also good to know so there's a, a couple little things there that I showed you on how to type on a path and uh, now you guys should be able to mess around with it and figure out what you uh, figure out some cool ways to make uh, typing on a path look really cool. So that's all I wanted to show you for that. Be sure to subscribe for some more awesome YouTube videos on Photoshop CS6. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next tutorial that I do. Everybody, have a good day.